What's up guys and gals, it's the Tyrant here, and today I'm going to be fulfilling another one of your Halo exploration requests. Today we're going to be figuring out where Foehammer goes on the Mission 343 Guilty Spark. This is the final video in the Dropship series for Halo Combat Evolved. We've already covered where Foehammer goes on the Silent Cartographer as well as the second mission in the game, so where does she go here? Now to pull this off, I went ahead and swapped out the Master Chief model for 343 Guilty Spark, so I do apologize in advance for seeing that blue light on the screen. Uh, it kind of comes with the territory when you play 343 Guilty Spark, but so what I wanted to do here is obviously wait for the Pelican to take off and then fly away. And here's the thing. So right out the gate, what happens is pretty straightforward. You know, she flies the Pelican for a little bit and then the Pelican disappears. This is the weird part. And maybe this is a Halo anniversary thing, or maybe, you know, my brains are just scrambled in that respect. Maybe I'm just remembering it wrong. But I could have sworn that she parks the Pelican somewhere on top of the map. And so to test this theory, I started doing laps around the map, the basically the outer edge as 343 Guilty Spark. And I did come across the secret Marine, the quote unquote secret Marine that's up here. Uh, so he's just standing around. Um, and that, but I, I looked all over the place and could not find a uh, faux hammer. It, it, again, this is weird because I could have sworn I saw somewhere and maybe it was just, you know, me doing tricks way back in the day when Halo Anniversary first came out. Maybe it's a Halo Anniversary thing, but on Combat Evolved, as far as I can tell, there's no sign of faux hammer anywhere. Uh, she just sort of despawns after she takes off. In terms of whether or not this applies to Halo Anniversary, uh, maybe it will, and maybe there's a separate video I can do sometime down the road where I focus solely on Halo Anniversary and, you know, just kind of make note of differences between that and the vanilla version of Halo Combat Evolved. Uh, but for now, it looks like she just sort of despawns off the map. So my curiosity is what did you guys think would, would happen uh, to Faux Hammer here? Because everywhere else she just despawns, but here I thought it might actually be a different story. Before we go, yes, I'll show you real quick uh, the the assault rifles that shoot at the flood here. I didn't want to do a separate video on this because General Kid has already covered this, uh, but I figured I'd just add it as a bonus here. Um, also, the the one other time Foe Hammer disappears uh, in the game is on the Maw. General Kid that did an excellent video on that as well, so uh, no reason for me to do it. But I wanted to hear your thoughts and opinions. What do you think is the mystery behind Foe Hammer? Is there a is there a difference between this and anniversary edition where maybe she does land on top of the map or maybe I just didn't look hard enough but I'd love to hear your thoughts and opinions and your theories in the comment section below or please feel free to hit me up on Twitter at Mythic Tyrant a link to my Twitter feed can be found in the description below and I want to take a moment to thank each and every one of you for taking the time out of your busy day to sit down and watch this video I hope you enjoyed it and if you did I hope you'll consider subscribing for more great content or right here on MythicTyrant.com thank you guys and gals so much for watching I hope you all have a wonderful day I will catch you all right back here next time and as always, I'm the Tyrant, signing off.